Hello everyone, today we have new video review and as you can see today we are going to talk about fresh book from the Lightwings. So this is a part of their airframe and miniature series. This is already 15th book and this time it is dedicated to Grumman F6F Hellcat. So it's a complete guide to the famous American naval fighter and here we have a commercial sample so it means you will get exactly the same stuff as what you'll see in this video and i have to say that it is really heavy and thick book here you can see it is soft cover but thickness is really impressive so they promise here more than 200 photos inside and of course there will be some builds there will be some um, tips on how to build a convincing copy of this famous aircraft so we are going to open it and check what is actually printed inside so it is written by richard franks by the way here we have a contents page and maybe i will close the camera so it won't be that bright so that you won't get blind because of this book review okay so here we have several chapters it's airframe chapters and miniature chapters there is also appendix with various uh, kits decals accessories for hellcat and of course bibliography is also there and note that there are in total more than 200 pages so that's why it is that thick Okay, so everything starts with short history introduction, which is accompanied with black and white photos. And I have to say that some shots are really interesting. They might be handy as a, I would say, reference for some diorama project, no matter which scale you choose. And then we go on with quite interesting chapter, because here you will learn more about differences between various versions of this aircraft. So I recommend to read it thoroughly so that you get better understanding. Next we go on with markings. So here we have some color print, it is uh, profiles and even some photos are color printed. And here is quite a useful thing because you will uh, learn more on how various, uh, I would say, units were distinguished by their markings on the tail. That was the main feature of the Hellcats, which was distinguishing them between each other. Next, we continue with uh, foreign service aircraft. There are um, many interesting markings as you can see so i think you'll find something uh, decent for your project as well next is a miniature chapter so here we go on with plastic kits as you can see there is a full list of various kits in different scales and author tries to describe their main advantages main problems so that you know what you will meet if you will choose such kit next we go on we can zoom in actually so that you can see more so this chapter is quite extensive because Hellcat is very popular among um, model manufacturers. Then we go on with build in 170 second scale, that's Edward Kit. As you can see we have here Hellcat MK1, MK2 and that's a profi pack, that's why we have some PE parts included. Next is a Cyber Hobby in 170 second. Here you can see Hellcat again from Edward, but this time it is in 148 scale. And one more is Trumpeteer 132nd. This one is really detailed, so if you are searching for something, I would say, more, more or less realistic, this might be a decent choice. And in 132nd scale it might be easier for some hands. But there is also offering from Airfix in 122nd, actually 24th scale. So it's even bigger, it's even more detailed, but of course it will uh, require more time for build. But as you can see, author describes uh, what was done on this model, why it was done like this, and which steps were required to achieve such appearance. Next we go on with this chapter, which is describing or showing the main differences with help of this dark gray cover. And I think it will be useful as well because some modelers like to achieve or modify their aircraft to a particular version, so that's why they will uh, use this as a reference guide. And then we go on with in-detail chapters, so here we can take a look, a uh, really close look at various parts of the aircraft. So for example here you can see everything starts with engine cooling and propeller, then we go on with cockpit, then here you have wing mechanization and control surfaces, of course, landing gear wheels, armament, and here you can see various external armament as well, antennas. 
and the last section is appendix. So here we have full list of plastic kits, accessories, decals, and of course bibliography with more books that you can read about Hellcat. And one more bonus here is set of drawings. So these uh, drawings are made in 148 scale, so they might be handy if you would like to rescribe your model or maybe to add some rivets on your aircraft. And here, by the way, you can see the price. So it's 23 British pounds because it's 22.95, so it's easier to say 23. In my opinion, it is really reasonable price for such publication and it is on the same level as previous issues, so you won't be surprised here. And of course, I will be happy to hear your opinion about this book here in the comment section below. If you like this video, don't forget to press the like button and subscribe to our YouTube channel. And I will see you in the next video review as usual. Thank you for joining me today and bye!